Hey guys, iHeartMovies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Alright, we are fighting Dragon Maleficent today, and she is kind of, sort of, rather hard. And I can't hit her for some reason. Pretty much just want to go right for her head. That's pretty much her only area you can hit her. And, yeah, just... Just... Uh, just... Uh, holy crap. Ow! God, Jesus. And my phone's buzzing, too. Can't really check it right now. Yeah, pretty much uh, standard boss deck for her. Just a bunch of high number of attack cards, a couple of cures, and a high number of potions. And later on, if I can actually get this right... Um... Oh, what the... Okay, what the... What the hell? Oh, okay. Jeez, I'm doing awful in this battle right now. And hopefully if I can show it off... We can get another... We can get a trick card here that we can use that'll really, really help out, actually. If I can never get it. If I don't, then oh well. Okay, let's reload. Hey, okay, there you go. Okay, we want to take out this fire. Just attack it. And keep attacking it. Get it out of the way. Oh, holy... Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. You know, I was going to say, trying to attack the fire, attack the flames there, did a trick card, and that'll cause a little stone ledge to appear. And you can just hop on that, and it's a lot easier to hit her head. Okay, let's reload and let's uh, try this again, or not. Ow. And pretty much, you know, just try to keep jumping, just go right for her head. Okay, so she has uh, two full bars of HP, so this will take a little while. Especially if you can't actually hit her freaking head. There's a trick card. Alright. Let's use that. There you go, there's that stone ledge. It's a lot easier to avoid her attacks and makes it a lot easier to actually hit her. If you can, yeah, if you can actually break through our cards. There you go, this is much easier now. <coughs> okay, let's use Donald and stock, stock that so I can use the uh, Kiara. That'll work. Okay, it's a lot easier to avoid our attacks up here. Or besides the uh, the bites, but other than that, just try to stay on the stay on the rock as much as possible. And just keep wailing on her, really. Nothing much to it. Got her. Ah. <coughs> Let's reload real quick. There you go, got her. A lot of experience points. Got the Dragon Maleficent enemy card. Oh, I wonder if that's silver. Or I haven't seen one of those yet, really. 1400 experience points. Nice. <coughs> Excuse me, that took longer than I thought. I you know, it took about three minutes or so, so not too bad. And yay, Bell is saved. How sweet. Oh, mushy stuff. Yeah, let's get out of here. <coughs> All right, let's take care of that. HP, I don't think I actually even need it. And go up the ladder, Sora. There you go. I think we only have one more world card left. Let's see what it is. 100 Acre Wood. That'll be the last world. And no Riku battle? Yeah, that's what I, I kind of thought too. He's been on the. He's been between floors after like the last like two or three. Let's hope he's done for now, because this is getting a little old. Yeah, I would hope not. Alright, well, let's head off to the 10th floor then. And, yeah, another cutscene.
<laughs> so half bait. Conniving little yes. Oh, who's that? Another member. Well, there are 13 people, and this is... Now, I've heard his name pronounced Marluxia or Marluxia. I'm just saying Marluxia. That's because I've always, when I first played this game, that's how I pronounced it. So, if it's wrong, it's wrong. I apologize. So, yeah. <coughs> yeah, your little toy Riku has failed twice now. Ooh, think you're so high and mighty because you're number four. I'm so scared. Oh, well, okay, never mind then. Looks like nobody really likes Betson. To the superior? Hmm. <coughs> I don't think they actually say who the superior is, at least in this game. They do over a lot more in Kingdom Hearts 2. Oh, it sounds fun. Nike, just do it. So, kind of sort of looks like Betson will be our next organization member we have to fight. We've already fought a few of them already. We fought Large Scene once, fought Atsil earlier in the castle. Is that it? Yeah, that's, that's been it for right now. <coughs> I wonder why I haven't found more of them yet. Oh well. I kind of wasn't paying attention to what they were saying. I was offering another tangent. No, oh, the 10th floor. Yeah, we have. Uh, we're no way to turn back now. Doesn't remember the promise? Oh. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Alright then, uh, let's head off to the 10th floor. Luckily, 100 Acre Wood is a very, very nice break from the uh, 7th, 8th, and 9th floors, being in this case Atlanta, Neverland, and Hollow Bastion, because there are no battles here whatsoever. Hey, it's Winnie the Pooh. Hi, Pooh. As if I really spoiled it, you know that's Winnie the Pooh. Oh, looking for my friends. And we didn't help you with that. I like the music here. Very, very nice and peaceful. <coughs> looking for nobody. Hmm. I don't see how honey can be very filling if you're really, really hungry. I just don't see it. Yeah, we have it to help. No, look for your friends, you silly little bear, you. Oh, you're so absent-minded. We're helping you look for your friends. Oh, silly Pooh Bear. That stupid headset slipping. There you go. Alright, let's go ahead and find them. Help Pooh find his friends as you lead him to the finish line. The R button is, to is used to call Pooh. <coughs> Honey displayed at the top right of the screen is the source of Pooh's energy. Pooh will doze off for a while if he runs out of honey. 
Alright then guys, so next time on Let's Play Teenage Mars Chain of Memories, we will help Pooh find his friends in the 100 Acre Wood. This has been I Movie Sign Off, guys. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.